All right, guys. Hey, what's up? Welcome to the video. So if you didn't see my video earlier, um, a, a issue was found with the GTA tool version 2.0. Um, it, but this only seems to be happening uh, people who are on decks. This has nothing to do with whether you pick the no textures or textures. This has nothing to do with that. It's just the GTA tool itself. I, I guess I loaded it with so much stuff. It's reached its limitation, um, you know, as to what it, it can load or whatnot. In Dex, it loads more because there's more menus. Um, so I guess it's probably reached that limitation. And, uh, and that's why things are getting screwed up. So not all 28 menus were displaying. It also seemed to just display, you know, whatever menus it wanted at random. But it was displaying like 19, 20, 21 menus, not all 28. So maybe you realized it. Maybe you didn't even know you were missing seven, eight, nine menus. Um, so the way to fix this was to put the menus onto their own tool, onto their own program. And uh, that seems to have solved it. So I'm on Dex. I... I tested it out extensively and everything seems to be working. Um, so let's go ahead and show you. You can take this package file and you can install it. Uh, this is something different from the GTA tool. So you can have the GTA tool still installed. You can see I have the GTA tool there and I have this one. This is now a different program. It's the uh, SPRX loader. Um, so I just put together this wallpaper and this icon and stuff really fast. But over the weekend, when I make changes to this and to the two main downloads, the no texture one and the texture one, I'm going to fix everything. And uh, and yeah, and, and I'll probably release a couple more packages as well. So you can update the GTA tool as well as update this one again. But for now, this one should get you through uh, at least through the weekend without any problems. So let's go ahead and go into it. And you're going to install this like any package file. And, uh, yeah, it'll install somewhere different other than, you know, where the GTA tool is. That way they don't mix up. And I'm thinking uh, I'm going to be testing out to see uh, about moving the eBoots out of the GTA tool and putting them here and then just having those two things. Since they go together, the, you know, Sprix menus and eBoots, there's only three eBoots that I would need to transfer. So um, if I'm going to transfer them, I'm going to test it, make sure everything works. If it works out okay, then the eBoots and the menus will be located here. And I'll remove them um, in the future updates from uh, the GTA tool. And uh, and yeah, everything should hopefully work out fine. Let's go into the SPRX menus. And if we go here and we just scroll, I'm going to start from the bottom and work my way up. So here's the last one, the um, your self-recovery. And I'm just going to keep working my way up. That way you can see that all the menus are here. <clears throat> And um, yeah, I don't know what the issue exactly is. I'm guessing there's a limitation on the memory, on the lines of script or script, uh, the strings or something. I don't know, but we'll figure it out. So anyway, now they're all here and everything is working great. If you want to use this, if you're on Kex and you want to use this, that's fine. Only the, um, oh, we went back up to the first menu. Only um, the 12 menus that are available to Kex people will show so you can use this uh, if you want but really this is only for Dex because they seem to be having the problem but again feel free to install if you're on Kex you can use this and the GTA tool in conjunction don't forget to install the eBoot from the GTA tool if you haven't already if you have already then you don't need to do it all right guys be on the lookout for the update to this and uh, the other stuff here in the next couple of days and the Black Ops 2 almost finished I should be releasing it hopefully tonight Thanks for watching, guys. We'll see you next time.